coffee grinder. Ah, coffee bread grinder, neutral bullet. Yes, yes, yes. I'm putting almond seed in here. The whole, the whole almond seed. End up in the little cup. This cover it up. Okay, I didn't put water in it at all. Okay, so remember, once you put it, you turn it. There we go. So, but what I will do, because because almond, remember, is so much fat in it, so it congeals together like peanut, pressing out the fat. So the what you can do is. You can put either powdered sugar or corn or flour or something to release it so it's not too... It works so smooth. You just congeal but it worked. Sure did. It congeals like this because of the oil and the almond flour. It worked. Wow. This is chia seed. This is chia seed. You see it? One of the most super seeds on this planet. So I need chia seed for my bread I'm making tomorrow, gluten-free bread. So let's see if it works with chia seed and we're in business. <laughs> it's around, no buttons to be pressed. So chia seed ready. Let's see how far. I don't know, is it worth it to so using my coffee grinder? <laughs> Coffee grinder versus neutral bullet and doing chia seed. This is so smooth. This is good job. It did a great job with chia seed. This is chia seed. This is chia seed when it's not blended. And this is the one the machine did. Put it in this hand. Chia seed. Boom. Machine, this is my coffee blender. I want to see, can, can it also do chia seed? $30 coffee blender. Let's see if it will work too. I put chia seed in it and see how far. The same amount. Coffee blender for chia seed. Putting bullets and gone. So let's bring it out and see how far. I squashed it. <laughs> the machine bullet. And they all have the same texture. For some reason, the one in my coffee blender looks darker. Coffee blender, chia seed done. You're good to go. Past exam, well, well. It's coffee blender, coffee grinder, neutral bullet. Super. Yes. Thank you, guys.